Welcome on in, everyone. We are back, the cousins. This is Beer Talk with Kyle and Joe. I'm Kyle. What's up, guys? I'm Joe. And as always, thank you so much for returning to our channel. We are super excited about this video. This is a first for us. So today, we don't have a review for you or a how-to video. We're going to be going over our Joe and I's top five <laughs> favorite beard oils for feel and beard. This, has, this video has nothing to do with what the products smell like, strictly how they feel and work for our beard. Right. You guys, you have no idea how excited we are to finally be doing this video. This is a long time in the making. This is a video that we wanted to take very, very seriously and put a lot of time, thought, and effort into it. So we hope you guys enjoy this just as much as we enjoyed putting this bad boy together. Now, just a little bit of housekeeping. We want you guys to know that in our top fives, there are going to be some companies in here that we have not done reviews uh, before. Uh, and that is because we've been using beer products a lot longer than we've had this channel. So we've been fans of these companies um, and their products even before becoming reviewers. And that means something to us. Um, and also, there's going to be some companies that you do see who are affiliates with us or were affiliated with them. Um, and again, that is something that is also special to us uh, because those are companies that we truly have a lot of belief in, uh, a good relationship, good relationships with, and um, just you know, overall awesome owners that we're proud to now call friends. So. With that said, if you have not subscribed to our channel yet, we would love for you to do so. Thank you for joining us. If you are viewing us uh, yet again, love to have you back. You know how it goes. Check out this intro and we're gonna see you in about 20 seconds. All right, guys, welcome back from the intro. So quick disclaimer before we go ahead and get started here. We just want to let you guys know, obviously, we're doing our top five. There are so many great companies out there. Joe and I have probably tried hundreds of them at this point. I thought this was going to be easy. This was incredibly difficult to come up with a top five list. Joe and I were even going to do a couple um, honorable mentions at the end. We couldn't even come up with that. The top five was hard enough to come up with. So we just want to go ahead and let you know that this isn't this is our top five, but there's so many great companies out there. I'm really excited to share this with you. I don't even know Joe's top five. So like we said, really excited to make this video. So what we'll do is Joe will uh, show us his number five oil, then I'll show my number five oil, then his four, then my four, so on and so forth. But Joe, go ahead and kick us off with your number five, my man. All right. So coming in at number five is a company that we have not done a review yet, uh, but a company that we know many of you enjoy and a company that we are enjoying right now. And that is none other than Broke Ass Beer Company. Okay. And man, right off the bat, this is an oil that just feels so good in, in, my, in my beard. It, it's an oil that goes right to my cheeks, right to my skin and it does everything that I need it to do from styling purposes to nourishing purposes. And that's all I can ever ask for when it comes to an oil. And, it's, and they're just doing great things. Awesome. Can, kick us off with your number five, man. All right, so this one, I almost wanna say is a wild card, but it's not, and I'll explain why in a second. So my number five is Beards Dignified. I love this oil. Why I say it's almost a wild card, I typically don't like thicker oils, typically. This is one of the very few exceptions because this is a bit of a thicker oil. I just love it. I can My beard style's amazing. Skin, beard feels moisturized all day. Apps, obviously, one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. All right, Joe, what's your number four? All right, number four, and we're getting into the big dogs already here. So, <laughs> none other than the ever popular Beard Octane, and let's see if my camera will focus really quick, even though you guys should already know what Beard Octane looks like. Uh, yeah, you wanna talk about a nice, thin-feeling oil, probably the lightest oil on my list. 
Uh, this is an oil that goes straight to my skin and just kills it when it comes to the nourishment. Another oil that allows me to style my beard exactly how I need it to be. Um, and just an overall experience. I love that thinness and I love the nourishment that you're supposed to get from any oil. That's what Octane does for me. Awesome. Kyle, awesome. kick us off, man. All right. So our number, or our number four, my number four feel, feel and beard oil is none other than Last Looks Grooming. I have loved this oil since the day I got it. To me, this is a perfect medium oil. If anything, it's just a hair on the thick side, but definitely in the medium category. I never have a bad beard day when I use this. This is one of those oils that's a perfect medium. It's gonna moisturize my skin and beard all day, but it's one of those oils that really helps keep my beard at bay. Love Last Looks Grooming. Awesome, yep. All right, coming into my top three, Number three is a company who is known for their presentations, but what needs to be talked about is exactly how their beard oil feels. None other than Nicholas Beardworks. Yeah, that presentation was just ridiculous. <laughs> right, yeah, you wanna talk about good presentation, you saw it right there, but let's talk about uh, feel and beard. Uh, Alex from Nicholas Beardworks is using crazy ingredients in all his products and it is quite the experience in, in in my beard and when i have it it's probably the thick most thick one on my list but it's not even like all that thick either but it is just i mean just straight up amazing for how i want to style my beard and again just when you're talking feeling beard how your beard is going to be nourished how your skin is going to feel um, I mean, just everything about uh, Nicholas Beardworks is what I'm looking for. So that is my number three. Hit us, Kyle. All right. So to break into my top three oil feel and beard is none other than Whiskey and Hardtack. Somewhat of a newer company. I just absolutely love this oil from the day I got it. This is one of those oils that makes my beard feel moisturized all day i mean this is one that 12 hours later i feel like i'm still wearing it that's so unique just absolutely love it always styles really well too just works so well with my thicker beard awesome yep um all right top two you ready for this i'm ready man hit me all right so number two for me is a company that is coming in hot and heavy right now and is just totally destroying the beard game right now. And when I say destroying, I mean, they're doing some amazing work. And we're talking about Bearded Mac. All right. The Bearded Mac is a company that has amazing ingredients in their, in their oils. And you feel every bit of those ingredients in your skin, in your beard. It styles amazing. Um, I mean, it's just an amazing experience. You have the broccoli seed oil, which is what they're most popular for. Right. Um, and it's just an amazing, amazing experience. So awesome. that's my number two. All right. So my number two, um, this was, they, it was all so difficult, but my top two, top three were just so, so tough. But my number three feel and beard is none other than Beard Octane like you said earlier, really needs no introduction. The thing that I love that stands out hands down about Beard Octane, thin, light oil. It is the probably the lightest oil that I've ever tried that works in my beard. Um, this might even be the, the best styling type of beard. It's just, when I, when I have this in, my brush, my comb just glides through my beard and it's just a feeling like none other. I'm, I absolutely am in love with the oil from Beard Octane when it comes to feeling beard. Awesome. All right, you guys. We need, number, we need to one. <laughs> number one. Top, top one. Um, on my list is a company that Kyle had mentioned already, and that is Whiskey and Hardtack. All right. So the owner is Holly, and Holly is just absolutely destroying it. This oil is my best feel-in 
product that I own and I absolutely love it. It is everything that I need in any sort of product for my beard. It is the perfect weight. It is the perfect uh, feel in for nourishment and it is perfect when it comes to styling. There is not one bad thing that I can say about this oil. Even if I tried to sit and come up with something, I, I couldn't even think of any sort of negative. Whiskey and Heart Attack is my number one best feeling oil. Awesome, man. Awesome. It's a good pick there. All right. So my number one oil, feel and beard, we haven't even seen yet, obviously, from my side. So my number one is none other than Husky Beard and Grooming. So um, this was actually one that is just, it's just near and dear to my heart. Um, we, we know Ray, awesome owner, awesome company, but that's not why it's the number one. It just, I never, ever, ever have a bad beard day when I wear this. This keeps my beard moisturized all day. The styling is phenomenal and the weight of this oil is perfect for my beard. And the weight is what it what attains to that perfect styling, perfect uh, keeping my beard, my skin, my hair moisturized. I just, it's impossible for me to have a bad beard day when I wear this stuff and I've worn it many times. Um, most of these, but especially Husky, I've been using way before we um, even had this channel. So that is my number one. And that is our top five beard oils, feel and beard. No, again, no, no sense or anything like that. Mm -hmm. So we're going to go ahead and throw a description. And if we have a discount code, we'll throw our a discount code. Some of those are affiliates where we get a small kickback. We'll go ahead and put that on there. Mm -hmm. um, we'll throw that in the description. Also, guys, comment to leave you with. How do you feel about our top five list? Did you like Joe's better? Did you like mine better? Or some of those that did you love? Some of those that you don't love? Or maybe you've never even heard of them. Go ahead and throw some commentary down there and we'll get the conversation started of how you feel about that list. But right. Joe, anything before uh, we go ahead and sign off here? All I'm going to say is, you know what? If you enjoyed this video, I would love nothing more than see some of your guys' top five if you guys, if you guys can muster it up. So right. uh, why don't you give us something good to read and we'll highly appreciate it. Remember, hit those thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. And uh, that, that's all we could ask for. Thank you guys so much. We couldn't do this without you. Right. Huge thank you to all subscribers, all of our viewers. So that is all the time that we have for this video. But as always, guys, keep it growing. And we'll talk to you at the next one. Take it easy, guys.